It is an almost daily scene in western Libya, black smoke rising to the sky from Misrata. On Wednesday morning, government forces resumed their shelling of the port from about 10 kilometers north of the city. By the afternoon, the rebels claimed they were in control of the area. 61 Libyan tribal leaders have signed a declaration of unity against Colonel Gaddafi, saying his propaganda has set the tribes against each other. A spokesman for the opposition claims overnight NATO airstrikes destroyed 37 vehicles. Following talks in Addis Ababa, the African Union, working for a political solution, had a clear message for NATO. Call on uh, the, uh, for, the, for the fighting to stop and for the uh, airstrikes to avoid targeting uh, senior officials of Libya as well as, as well as infrastructures of the country. Hundreds of sub-Saharan migrant workers were still waiting near the port to be evacuated. It's reported one was killed while seven other people died. One aid ship was able to dock, hoping to take the wounded and workers to safety. The situation is changing constantly.